Hey guys, how's it going? Danish here from GM Tech and we're here with Huawei to get a look at their all new Mate X. Yes, this is the Mate X, their 5G foldable device, which is absolutely amazing. We have checked it out and the first thing right off the bat that I can tell you is that it feels absolutely amazing in the hand. Um, it's not as delicate as I expected it to be. It does not feel as um, fickle that I thought the plastic would feel. Um, as you can see, the software seems to work pretty well. Um, we've checked out, we've used the phone quite a bit. We've done uh, a bit of gaming. In gaming, as well as video watching, we found that the phone was extremely, extremely immersive. Um, once you open up the device, which by the way, does not feel delicate in any way or form. I mean, I'm doing this repeatedly and it, it's, it's, it doesn't feel delicate. You do see what people are calling creases, but I think that's something that's gonna be around for a while, as long as um, the, the, the displays are in their plastic form. Apart from that, as you can see, um, a full eight inch by 7.1 inch ratio. It looks absolutely gorgeous. Um, while using it, you don't, it, it feels natural. It feels like this was something very well thought out. On this side, on the right side, they've added this grip over here. Now the grip basically is where they place the camera, the processor, the antennas and stuff like that. Um, using the phone uh, as long when you're in the system or when you're in your email again like i said it just feels very very natural um, it doesn't feel like uh, something new something that you have to learn um, transition between the two if you're let's say you're checking your email and you transition back into this phone mode it is just it's instantaneously back and because this is a um, 19 by 9 now 19.5 by 9 ratio it just feels like a normal smartphone um, uh, again with a minimal bezel not the smallest in the world but a minimal one um, and yeah it just it, it absolutely feels gorgeous it's 11 meters uh, thick when it's folded and comes down just to five point something when it is opened up um, very very comfortable in the hand now one of the main aspects on the hardware you'll notice is the wing. It's called the Falcon Wing and it's patented by Huawei and it has over a hundred components. Um, very nicely built. Uh, it's built completely for the outward fold. So it, it seems to work well. The phone itself clasps into, um, there's a little button over here to open the device up. So you can see over here, it opens up. Um, this clasp basically uh, just keeps everything locked in, I guess, and it doesn't seem to be loose. The phone itself does not seem to have any issues. Uh, on the right side of the device, you've got the fingerprint sensor, you've got the volume control button. The fingerprint sensor also is your power button because, well, nothing can be on the left side because that's the display itself. The body itself is great. On top, we've got the SIM card slot as well as Huawei's favorite IR blaster. You, On the bottom, you've got the speaker grill as well as the charging port. The phone comes with two batteries. Both split into each of these parts. Two batteries which total up to 4500 milliamps and have um, the charger itself is 55 watts. So basically you get 80% uh, of your charge in 30 minutes which is amazing because someone who's going to be buying this phone is going to be buying it for its biggest advantage which is productivity. Um, whether you want to game, whether you want to work, whether you want to just chat, whether you want to be involved uh, in the internet the way it is around you, everything comes down to the fact that you've got this gorgeous 8 inch display. We did take a bit of a look at the camera. Um, so the beauty of this is that it's a triple camera setup with an ultra wide telephoto as well as a, a normal wide lens. But um, we do think it has uh, some features that are yet to be released like a 30x zoom and stuff like that. We did get to play with it but we're not going to show anything because it was very much in its trial phases. Um, but on the overall, um, th this is a great, great start for uh, Huawei. Everything that you have um, shows that foldable phones do have potential in the market. Thank you very much for watching. Do take a look at um, the other content we have comparing this to the Galaxy Fold, uh, as well as our initial look at the device. Uh <laughs> yeah, thank you very much for watching and we'll see you at the next one.